Good night at 10. A local attorney is now facing theft allegations. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rob Williams. And I'm Megan O'Rourke and Patricia tonight. Now we first told you about Jennifer Zacchaeus Miller last night after she was arrested for stealing $26,000 from an estate. And tonight we're hearing from a woman who says Miller also stole from her grandmother's estate. Our Courtney King joins us now with these new allegations against her. Courtney. Yeah, Megan and Rob, right now Jennifer Zacchaeus Miller is being held in the Campbell County Detention Center. She's been charged with contempt of court and theft. That's what we reported last night. And a woman contacted us and told us Miller also stole from her grandmother's estate, which makes it at least two different estates that we know of. We were able to verify this woman's claims with authorities that the allegations are being investigated. We're, we're really mad. This woman didn't want to show her face on camera, but she says this attorney, Jennifer Zacchaeus Miller, stole from her grandmother's estate. The fact that she evaded it for so long, you know, I'm not surprised that she was stealing. This comes after we reported Miller is accused of stealing $26,000 from a different estate. We tried to have her removed. Um, she didn't get removed. Campbell County Police posted Friday Miller was missing, but then posted Monday she had been found. Court documents obtained by Fox 19 allege Miller turned off her phone and left town. Kentucky State Police found her in the wilderness at Red River Gorge on Monday. She was booked in the Powell County Detention Center before being moved to Campbell County. So when you saw that she was missing, what did you think happened? I thought she left the country with everyone's money because I know that there is no way in the world that there can't be just us. The woman we talked to says the court appointed Miller as the attorney over her grandmother's estate when she passed. She spent her whole life, you know, saving this money and, and not spending money and, um, you know, wanting to leave a legacy and now it's gone. She says Miller was often difficult to get a hold of, but let them inside her grandmother's home to gather belongings before it was sold. After that was sold and the deposit went into the account, she proceeded to steal that too. Do you have an idea of how much money is Gone. Um, from us, it's over $200,000. Yeah. The documents we obtained say Miller wrote a letter to her significant other admitting she stole from clients and intended to replace the funds. The woman says she's relieved Miller is behind bars. She can't scam anybody else. And those court documents say authorities have been informed about other estates handled by her with missing funds, and authorities say additional charges are likely. Jennifer Sakias Miller will be in court on Monday. Guys. Thank you very much.